What's up guys, Cubologist here again today with episode number 12 in our Road to Full OLL series. Today we're going to be covering cases number 13 and 14. Alright guys, today we're going to start off with case number 13. It's another L shape OLL and it's a lot like the last ones, but you recognize it a little differently. So, when you're trying to recognize this case, you look for the L shape on this side of the cube with a 2x1 block in front, but on the right this time. There's a 2x1 block in the back, but it's on the left. And then this top right piece is facing out to the right. And the algorithm you use to fix this case goes like this. F u r u prime r2 f prime r u r u prime r prime and here's how I execute this algorithm the next case we're going to cover today is OLL number 14 another L shape now the way you recognize this case is by you have the L oriented like this. You see on the front of the cube, you have a two by one block facing you on the left. On the back of the cube, there's a two by one block facing away on the right. And then this top left piece is facing to the left. So this is how you want to hold the cube to fix this case. Then you do the following algorithm. R prime, F, R, U, R prime, F prime, R, then you do a Y prime rotation, R, U prime, R prime, and that will orient your layer. Now as you know, most of these OLLs are pretty new to me, I'm just learning them as we go along, but this is how I execute this case. I use my thumb to push up on that F prime about halfway through the algorithm, and that works for me. Alright guys, well that's going to be the only two cases that we're going to cover today. Uh, even though they're mirrors of each other, they're a little more difficult than the last cases that we did because the algorithms don't really mirror each other that well. But I hope you found them easy to memorize and execute, and if you're following along, go ahead and subscribe, and I hope to see you soon guys. Thanks for watching.